this in-depth walkthrough of my texture painting process in Blender. In this five-part tutorial, I'm going to show you how I approach texture painting in Blender but with a more substance painter-like attitude. I'm going to walk you through how I textured this hero asset using only simple node setups, some custom-made brushes, and straightforward hand painting. That's it. No complex node setups that confuse you or anyone you may collaborate with later. You also don't need a degree in rocket science to understand what each node is doing and you'll have all the control over your textures and shaders that you need. In section one, we're going to cover setting up our workspace. We'll discuss importing and using custom made brushes and just get ready to start working. In section two, we'll set up our basic shaders and connect them, getting them ready for painting. I'll discuss how I plan ahead and think in terms of layers when setting up my shaders. In section three, we're going to cover decals. I'll discuss my method for painting on decals using custom made stencils, roughing them up, and how to tackle Blender's particular approach to this type of texture painting. In section four, we'll continue on into blending our layers together and really start making the magic happen. We'll focus primarily on adding damage and wear using custom brushes and a bit of our imagination. In section five, we'll add dirt and grime and begin to refine our asset. At the end of this section, you'll have a completed asset that you can step back and admire. You'll have learned my approach and workflow for texturing in Blender. All of the assets for this course have been included, including the model. You'll work on the same blend file as I am, and all of the free textures are included. Also, as a thank you for purchasing this course, you're also receiving my latest brush pack, aptly named Damage Pack, which includes 15 custom-made brushes and 5 custom-made seamless textures. You'll also receive an invite to my members-only Discord, where you can ask questions and get help when needed. Or if you just want to hang out and chat, that's cool too. This mini course contains more than two and a half hours of video learning. It has areas where you work on what you've learned on your own before coming back to continue on in the process. Kind of like little homework assignments that reinforce what you've learned. So if you're a Blender user who struggles with texturing or are intimidated by complex procedural node setups that take what feels like forever to build out, or maybe you're just looking into building a texture workflow that avoids paying a subscription fee, this mini series is for you. Take your texturing and painting workflow to the next level and keep it simple at the same time. Let's get started.